Hello everyone, welcome to the channel Rad here from Radko Tarot and this is going to be Leo Sun, Leo Moon and Leo Rising weekly tarot reading for September 17 to September um, 23rd 2018 weekly uh, tarot and Lenormand reading and uh, while I'm shuffling I want to remind you that this is a, a general reading for the star sign of Leo and it is not your personal reading <coughs> For personal readings, um, you can go to my website, which uh, link is uh, written down below in the description of this video, and uh, there you will find a full list of my services as well as their pricings. And at this uh, the end of the summer, there is a uh, summer sale that it is going on, uh, which adds 10 minutes on the top of the 30 minutes um, service. So that being said, uh, we are going to go to the uh, tower reading first and now let me uh, cut the cards. <clears throat> and that is going to be a four card spread. The first card will um, define the topic for your week. The second card is about the core of the situation. The third card it is about the challenges that you Leo have to overcome for the duration of the week. And the last card <clears throat> it's about the the uh, guidance that the tarot has to offer to you. So let's see what we got here. Now the first card is about the hermit. So the hermit uh, defines a, a substantial events or very important things that are happening in one's life, which really gives a direction in uh, in one's purpose. So you can expect this week, Leo, uh, something significant to happen either into your career or either into your relationship, which is going to give you a, a further direction in which you will have to embark on and move on. Um, a very favorable card, especially for those who are wondering what their purpose in life is. As <clears throat> The Hermit card resembles all that we are following in a sense of that this for many of us is the light that shines for us into the darkness which means that that will be a um, a significant undertaking which for in many cases will give a, a meaning in our lives should we have lost sense for it should we have lost meaning of our personal lives that could be that could manifest in many different ways <clears throat> For example, it can manifest for those who are jobless, finally finding a, a long-term job, those who are single, finally finding their suitor, etc., etc. But the Hermit card as well is associated with one seclusion in a sense of that one um, withdraws from the ideas of the world and from the ideas of others just so that particular person, you know, can um, analyze its emotions, its... Um, its yearnings as well um, so they can afterwards when they uh, return back into the world know what they have to do with their lives so it's kind of like um, <clears throat> this week will play a major role in your life in the sense of that you will get back on track with a specific area of your life either career-wise either relationship-wise or even for both of it but the hermit card as many readers interpret as a um, isolation you know being alone etc etc doesn't have to manifest that way I mean it's just <clears throat> a uh, realization of one's greater purpose, of one's higher purpose and uh, what kind of a means one needs in order to follow that specific purpose. And the core of the situation or why the hermit takes place, that is the hangman here. So it does look like that this is going to be a, a week of a, a huge revelations. <clears throat> Because the hangman usually points to blockages, delays, and sitting in one place, futile efforts as well. So uh, you, Leo, are going to realize why your efforts until this very moment, either to find, uh, to find a new job, to be happy into your relationship, for example, or into your relationship uh, why, um, lives, or why you are not finding the right person for yourself, for example... <clears throat> 
are futile and what you need to do in order to change that and this is going to give as i said a, a new purpose for your life or it's going to set you back on track with your life purpose etc etc but a, a very very significant week is coming in your way in which you are going to overcome a certain blockage which most likely makes you quite miserable or the very least makes you quite unhappy and the challenges that you have to overcome here this is going to be the six of cups card and the six of cups <clears throat> it's a very petite challenge to be overcome because uh, usually the six of cups refers to the small pleasures that one can have and the creative expression that one can give so that will come to a challenge for your behalf to fear to experience pleasure from the very first steps you know of the uh, new direction that you're going to give into your life that meaningful direction and as we all know you know the coin has a two sides and you cannot have the coin without having both of the sides and most likely you have to face the negative side or rather the chores of what you need to um of what you need to initiate or what you have to deal with you know in in this particular week first and that will come as a challenge to you um so given to that it doesn't look like that every single enterprise you're going to involve yourself in this week is going to be a pleasant one however it is a, a one that needs to be uh, experienced it is one that needs to be lived through if I may express myself that way as it will be substantial for um, you know the purpose of your life and the purpose of one's life does not include being always happy you know it includes also the dirty work and maybe the realization of that there is going to be a dirty work behind it it's the very reason why you have to overcome the sense that not everything you are going to attend to while following your purpose um, <clears throat> regarding that specific field of your life will be kind of pleasant and then we do have the next card which refers to the guidance here that will be the ace of pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles advises you first to be uh, very, I would have said careful, but the right word here is more like meticulous about your performance and about your uh, preparation as well regarding those kind of activities, either career-wise or either relationship-wise. As we said here, this is going to be overcoming blockage and establishing a, a long-term path with one of one's devotion and of one purpose in life. And if you don't prepare for itself meticulously, you don't think it, uh, we don't think it, th think it through thoroughly then most likely you're going to kind of um, miss a very important matters along the way which furthermore are going to cause you a certain predicament therefore <clears throat> At uh, the very first an initiative step of how you can make your thorough preparation here and thorough research is by establishing harmony into your relationships, not just only uh, intimate relationships, but as well friendships, etc., etc. And whatever field of your business and of your career you can establish success, this is what you need to follow. So very, uh, so very much this card points not to waste any effort, you know. Uh, regarding activities and undertakings in which you are not feeling very secure at that you can bring them to their very end but rather focus your um rather focus your efforts your knowledge you know and your skills into all those kind of an undertakings and enterprises in which you are feeling a hundred percent confident uh, confident you know that you can execute them and you can uh, bring them to their very end and most likely this is going to uncover your um <clears throat> a part you know of your life purpose because i do believe that pe that one person has many life purposes it's not just one that's why we live multiple lives here you know because we have to accomplish all of them and uh <clears throat> yeah this is for you defining one of them should you be able to accomplish it well that's a, a different story but at the very least you leos are going to find 
uh, what life wants from you in general for the duration of this week by uh, overcoming a certain blockage. This is what the reading says. It's not going to be very pleasant, but uh, it will be. Um, <clears throat> the results are going to be long lasting and they should be beneficial. And the very least, you have to aim to reach, as I said, harmony into uh, your relationships in any kind of form of manifestation and as well in whatever field of your business you can establish success this is the field where you throw your efforts at and now let's see what the Lenormand cards has to say for you what kind of event they are going to predict to happen in which, uh, which you should either look forward to or try to avoid All right, so we do have the cross, which speaks for grief, suffering, and also um, emotional trouble, emotional distress. Then we do have the sight, and this card doesn't have a specific meaning. It is just reverse the meanings and the meaning of the next card, which is the snake. So uh, a very positive, uh, very positive Norman reading. It does points that you are going to uncover either a traitor or a certain betrayal that uh, you have been victim of, you know, or uh, in general, you know, you will be, or you will be able to take advantage of a certain knowledge that you do have. These are the manifestation of those um, Lenormand cards. And of course, neither of those will be very easy for you to take on as it's going to involve a certain comfortability, for example, just to give you an example here, you uh, realize that a friend of yours is a traitor. He, they, they try to betray you here, all right? And even though it is hard for you to do something about it, because most likely you have uh, you have a emotional attachment to that person, realizing that is going to cause a certain suffering here, uh, feeling poignant, etc., etc. But in the same time, you will know which of, of these people uh, sabotages your work, let's say, and you will not allow to have that to happen going further into your future. So it's kind of like this is probably the blockage that you are going to overcome for the duration of the week and as I said it's not going to be easy for you as the six of cups displayed it's not going to be pleasant because you have to confront that person that you had into your closer closest environment and to basically as I said confront them and most likely cut ties with them so that being said this was your weekly tarot and Lenormand reading Leos for uh, September 17th to September 23rd 2018 I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it and again this is not your personal reading guys this is the general reading for the star sign of Leo for personal readings you can go to my website which link you can find down below in the description of this video and there you are going to uh, find the full list of my services as well as the pricings of them that being said rat signing out now see you next time bye